product and the most important of any look is your eyebrows. This product is $193. It's from Wet n Wild and this is a great eyebrow pencil. All you need is a sharpener. It's very pigmented, very easy to work with. This is my holy grail. I swear by this. So now that we're moving on to the face, we're going to need a primer and an affordable primer is Black Radiance HD Primer. It is $6.88. You need a primer so that your foundation will stay in place. So the foundations that I've chose are Black Radiance and Milani 2-in-1. These are both very affordable under $5. Another great foundation is Maybelline Fit Me. As you can see, they have a really wide range of products for a lot of skin types. Okay, so now that we have our brows, our face, we need contour and highlight. So a great contour highlight palette is Black Radiance. I personally use powder contour, but this is cream. So this comes with a contour shade, a highlight shade, and then a cheek highlight. Now this is the one that would go right here, and this is the one that would go underneath your eyes, and this is for the cheek. This is a really great product. I use the powder one myself. Another good cream contour palette is from e.l.f. I've never used this before, but it's very affordable, and e.l.f. tends to have really good product. Then your final step for your face is you need to set your foundation in place. So this is the pressed powder from Black Radiance. This product is 412 and this is a really great product. Another good blush is the Maybelline Fit Me blushes. I use these blushes and it's really affordable, it's small, it's very pigmented. ELF has really, really good blush palettes for darker toned women. I swear by them, I've used them before, I really love them a lot. And to end our face, everybody loves a good glow. So Maybelline has the Master Chrome Highlighter. A lot of people like this product. It works well for a lot of different skin tones. It's very pigmented. And then to top everything off, mascara, or you can do lashes. And of course, you need brushes. Now, you can't necessarily use the cheapest brushes because your product won't come out the best, but a really good drugstore brush brand is Real Techniques. Real Techniques has beauty blenders and face brushes. This is like a basic face set. You have your foundation and contour brush and concealer brush, and then you have a beauty blender that you blend everything in with. Now, both of these are about $20. Now, you can buy one brush at a time and work your way up to it, but most importantly, you need a beauty blender. Some even more affordable brushes are e.l.f. brand brushes. They have so many. They have some for face, contour, blush, eyeshadow. e.l.f. is also a really great brand for affordable products. I suggest that you pick up e.l.f. products and work your way through it and see how you're feeling and then move on to real techniques and more expensive brands and if you want to you can finish your look off with some lippies i'm personally a clear gloss type of person but l'oreal maybelline black radiance and milani have really great lippies and we can't forget the last part removing your makeup properly removing your makeup properly is so important because it can really help your skin if you don't take your makeup off all the way it'll be clogging your pores you know so my personal favorite neutrogena wipes it comes with 25 and it's 447 or you can use a cotton pad and use this Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water and you just put it on the cotton pad and take your makeup off. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Me going to the store, picking my favorites out to help you start up your makeup collection. Good luck with your start. It's my picked out items of to help. Start again or just keep it going? I'm gonna start again. <laughs> You're going too fast. <laughs> okay, I kind of want to like throw stuff in my bag.